praise the lord making selections morning manna july 8th out of the ground the lord god formed every beast of the field and every fowl of the air and brought them unto adam to see what he would call them and whatsoever adam called every living creature that was the name thereof genesis chapter 2 verse 19 Having given man wonderful wisdom and understanding, God now gives him a chance to exercise it. It was an honor and privilege conferred on man to name all the animals and fowls. Besides, it was a test to see whether he would select one of them to be his helpmate. There were the nightingales who were talented in singing, the peacocks with amazing beauty and animals that were gracious and gentle in appearance. If man had made a selection, he could have selected only an animal as his helpmate. Some children of God select a partner for themselves without the guidance of God, and lo, and behold, it is nothing less than an animal in nature and behavior. Of course, man could have given excuses for making a choice by saying, after all it is God who brought him or her to me. I did not go in search of him or her. Yes. God brought them unto Adam but not so that he may marry one of them, but so that he may see what he would call them Tatis. He was to distinguish one animal from another and one fowl from another, and not take one of them as his helpmate. Child of God, do not make a selection on your own. We find Adam taking the victory in this test. He gave them names befitting each one and did not find among them a helpmeet for him. Have a day of being upheld by God's love. Subscribe and press the bell icon below for more biblical creatives. Your subscription may bring you a free gift and God's lot of blessings.